not good at this YouTube stuff. <laughs> welcome or welcome back to my channel i'm getting a hamster today i'm so excited i'm getting a hamster today and i decided to make like a little video because i haven't made a video in about two or three weeks maybe even four i wanted a hamster for a long time today's the day i can finally get one i'm gonna try to do like a little vlog if i do anything else interesting so stay tuned So we're in the car now. Oh my gosh, this lighting is hitting. I can't even see. We're on the way to the pet store now. Hi guys, I'm on the way to the pet store. So we just got to, can you, can you see? We're at PetSmart now. You like my Crocs? Oh, I love them. <laughs> Where the next shipment of animals that we get in will be on this upcoming Tuesday. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I think I'm gonna get this because I don't have a bottle yet. Hey, also, I don't have a hamster yet, but I got some other stuff for it because the lady at the pet store said, What'd she say? She said they didn't have all of them on the floor yet because they were quarantining them. So they just got a few in stock. I wanted to go to another PetSmart to see if they had like more options before I make like my final decision. Cause they didn't have a lot of options. They had three of the same type. So we just got to the pet store, another pet store to see. Oh, I see a guinea pig. Oh. We're here and let's see if they have some cute hamsters. You know. They don't have hamsters. They had guinea pigs, um, birds, and that was it. In the store we went in, we had to wear masks. Like, if, if you didn't have a mask, you, you couldn't come in. I still don't have a hamster. I'm not gonna get a hamster until like, I don't know, five or something. Maybe, maybe my dad can take me. He's probably up right now, so he might take me. He probably not though. <laughs> we left pet supermarket and they didn't have any hamsters they had guinea pigs and birds i think i already said that already we left dollar general and got pizza and other stuff for the hamster but we don't have a hamster so we've been calling places and some don't have any at all some don't have any boys some have like a limited variety like one one type of hamster hopefully i could get it today so we just left dollar tree and got a few things for the hamster next stop is the house okay y'all so i just got home i'm about to do a little haul for y'all it's haul time first i'm gonna start with the pet smart bag i need some lip gloss actually i want to wear the all right so let's start with PetSmart I got a water bottle this water bottle is for cages but I don't like cages I might get a tank or a um storage bin yeah it's glass and it has a no drip nozzle then I got this bridge so that I can put it between the regular bedding in the sand bath so it can just climb up and go over that's all I got from PetSmart because PetSmart is mad expensive for no reason 
I want some big blocks too. And I got some contact paper because I'm putting a new table in my room. I'm gonna be putting it over there. Then I went to the Dollar Tree and I got this scooper. It's a litter scoop for a dollar so I can scoop up the bedding. Then I got this. This is a garland. Just to make it look more like natural, I'm gonna like just put this around the tank or bin or whatever I get. That's all I got from Dollar Tree. Then I went to Dollar General. I got a candle. It smells so good. Um, the next thing I got was this measuring spoon set to scoop out the food. This is gonna be the food dish. Speaking of food, I have to show y'all the other stuff that I got the other day. I think it was Wednesday. I got some other things, so I'll show you that too. I got some bedding. This is KT clean and cozy natural because I'm going for like a natural theme you'll see in some of the things that I'm about to show you I got a silent spinner wheel this is six and a half inches I got some food this food has pellets grains and seeds getting all the extra stuff like the treats and all the stuff that's not even necessary is not good to be giving your hamster as a daily food I got some, what are these, willow sticks for them to chew on, or it, for him, or her. Their teeth never stop growing, so they need stuff to chew on, and this reduces boredom. When hamsters are living their life in boredom, it can stress them out and cause them to die, so. You want to make sure you have everything lined up for your hamster, so you don't kill them, basically. And if you know anything about hamsters, you would know that critter trails don't even get me started on critter chills if you know you know period that's it simple next pet store bag this is a hide it has two rooms two bedrooms period living luxury and it's wood because like i said i wanted that natural wood theme everything in this haul is going to be wood i got this tunnel and that was everything i got on wednesday that was my little haul i'm like really tired right now i kind of just want to go eat my pizza i'm gonna tell you guys what i have left to do i want to go go get the hamster i want to get the tank or whatever i'm putting it in i have lots more things to do but um i'm not really gonna be doing much in the meantime until about Five, when my mom gets done with work then we will go get the hamster i'll update you guys then i'm probably gonna take a little nap eat a slice of pizza and here's a little update on life i got my pizza it's like 12 12 30 yeah it's like 12 30 right now i'm about to take a nap i'm getting all comfortable because I'm mad tired. Hey guys, so I just woke up. It's 4.48. And I still don't have a hamster. I still don't have the cage. I still don't have the desk in here. I can't leave now. Because we don't have a car. My dad has the car. Don't know when he's going to get back. So I might not get a hamster today. So my dad just called and said he was down the street. So we're going to get there on time. I'm, I'm glad we're gonna get there on time. Hey guys, so it's 529 and we're on the way to the pet store now. So hopefully we get there before six because it's 20 minutes away and there's gonna be traffic, so.
about Oreo. That's his name. Marble contact paper, and I'm just gonna cover all the wood surfaces with the paper to hopefully make it look cuter and girlier. And then I'll put the hamster cage on top and show you all. I'm basically done at this point. This is what it's looking like. So I just set the LED lights up on top of it, and this is the finished product. It looks pretty good. And I also forgot about this. Um, it's by Ashland. It's just called Naturals. So I'm going to just put this in his cage for extra decoration or if he wants to chew on it. I'm going to try not to get any sunflower seeds. I'm going to use those as treats. So over here we have his sand bath and a garland, a bridge that leads him into his sand bath. Here's his like burrowing area. Oh, and over here by his food, he has some mulch and a wood tunnel, some rocks. He has his, I think it's 13 and a half inch wheel, his house. And under here is actually another tunnel, more garland. Not only can he go in this one, but there's a second part over there. The tunnel literally goes all the way down here. And then it turns. And he can come out and go into his house. Just throw it right there. 
he'll probably chew on it. Yeah, and then there's his water bottle, and he can sit on the rocks to reach it. And I'm gonna put all of his stuff here, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I put his measuring cup. These are willow sticks, some of his shoes. This was the extra bedding from this. I also got a really huge bag from probably about the floor up. The bag is big because honestly, I thought that bag wouldn't have been big enough. Down here, we have a critter trail. As you can see, it's, it's way too small for a hamster. This is the cage it's in, and that's the critter trail. If I'm cleaning out the cage or something, I would probably just put Oreo in here. Yeah, that's it for Oreo. So, he's a black bear hamster. His name is Oreo. He has a little bit of white on his stomach. His paws are white, and he has a little bit of white on his um, chin. I thought Oreo was the perfect name for him. He's so adorable. Oh, he likes the chew. I'll make more videos with Oreo if you're interested. Say bye.